Hi, this is Guy from Salty Reefers bringing you another quick video. How you doing, folks? This is day seven, so one week after installing the new SB Reef Lights uh, 30 inch ramp in LED. So I had one um, coral bleach, but it was nothing to do with um, the new LED. It was actually an issue caused by myself. When I had the metal halide on the, the tank, on the front of the, the canopy, I had a two inch uh, wide LED with like 30 LEDs in it with two UVs, which were actually, it was across the front at an angle going so it wasn't direct it was actually at an angle focusing across the top of the tank well what I did I actually moved it to the back of the tank as you can see well two of the the diodes which is this one and this one were UVs and when I did that when I moved it directly under the LED the coral is bleached out as you can see and it bleached out so quick I couldn't do anything about it at this present moment I have the channel with the UVs turned off but what I'm actually doing I've ordered quite a few different wavelengths uh, diodes and I'm going to replace the two UVs because that light is not adjustable it's either full on or off so what I'm going to do is replace the UVs with um, either something in the 450 wavelength or the 420 nanometer wavelength and get rid of the UVs in that light other than that back to what we was talking about the SB Reef Lights 30 inch ramp in LED. Honestly, um, nothing but great stuff. Uh, coral still changing color. This SPS was totally green. It's now going uh, darker, more of a purple color. Again, it, this camera doesn't pick it up. There's also a new uh, Gatorade bird's nest in there, which I picked up on Sunday. And that's in various places around the tank. And that's um, pink branches with lean green tips. A couple of frags made at the back. But yeah, so that one coral bleaching is a, uh, at least I know what did it from the other light. And of course, where the other UV is coming down is directly on a rock, so there's no damage done there. So I'm really surprised. Um, again, it, I think it may be early days, but my experience, you know, going from the halides to this when I've always used halides has been good so far and again I don't wanna you know jump too soon and say yeah everything's fantastic I still love the halide in case something goes wrong but things are going really right at the moment everything looks good you know corals look fuller the anemones are definitely more fuller since the change so at the moment it's now 
330 um, this is where the lights are at their peak at the moment and I have the whites on 50% the blues on 65 and although there's only four UVs on the moonlight channel I actually turned them down to 35 so at the moment throughout the day they don't get higher than 35 I may even take the lenses off the UVs and try and give it a better spread not so much of a focus light and if I'm thinking the wrong way please let me know I'm certainly not an expert with LEDs let's put this uh, back on my tripod so there you are folks uh, my first week my final uh, week is over I'll update you in another few days uh, please subscribe to my videos comment please thumbs up and when you're on Facebook pop over to Salty Reefers to say hi. Thank you for watching. Have a great day.